The May flooding marks uh, the second time within a year. Some homes in the Thoroughbred Farms area found water rushing into their homes. This is the same neighborhood where a 67-year-old woman was swept away from her home last October. That woman, Inez Garza, lived on Citation Avenue, where a mobile home now stands. Her family and neighbors had been working to rebuild. As KXAN's Kylie McGivern reports, they are now going through an eerie deja vu. We had already moved back. Everything was already back in place, more or less. A place filled with memories. My plan was to give everybody their pictures. So now they're wet. Now, for the second time, barely recognizable. Strength. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. You can see the strength of the, of the water for it to knock this down. Rushing waters wiping away months of Sylvia Mojica's family's work. Some did painting, some did sheetrock, some did plumbing. But not years of faith. I think she's the one that saved us last time also. A symbol of hope and close by a reminder, Sylvia says, of something bigger than the storm. The Bible was open there. I don't know how he got there, I don't know. I always open it to Psalm 91, and it was open to Psalm 91. Psalm 91 has to do with uh, asking God to, to help you, to protect you. I feel that it's helped us. I mean, people go like, oh, yeah, look at all this. But what I'm seeing is our lives. Her husband having a harder time, telling us between tears this home holds everything he has. We're just going to go ahead and just move on. My family comes first, so, you know, all this, yeah, it's hard because my husband worked so hard to get all this, but I have him, I have my family, and, you know, and that's what keeps us going, too, the family. In Travis County, Kylie McGivern, KXAN News.